Welcome to the Flycraft Repair Guide. Today, we are repairing a seam leak. You will need a spray bottle, paper towels, latex gloves, aqua seal, and dish soap. Fill the spray bottle with a mix of water and dish soap. The first step is to inflate your floor to 0.5 bar. Then we will take our soap spray and spray along the seams of the floor. The most common place for a seam leak is where multiple seams come together. You will see bubbles rising where the leak is located. Once you find the leak, wipe away the soap and make sure the repair area is as clean as possible. Mark the location of the leak with a sharpie. You can now deflate the floor by turning the valves a quarter turn to the left. Next, take a small dab of aqua seal and apply it to the leak. We like to spread the sealant around to ensure it stops the leak. With the sealant applied, we will now switch the hand pump to the deflate position. Remove the hose and connect it to the port that says DEF. Now we will use the hand pump to create suction and deflate the floor entirely. This process draws the aqua seal into the repair, giving you a layer of sealant on the inside and outside of the leak. Once your floor is completely deflated, press the valve in and rotate a quarter turn to the right so that the floor stays under a small amount of vacuum pressure. Let the floor sit for 12 to 24 hours in order for the aqua seal to completely cure. We hope this video helped you repair your floor so that you can get back out on the water. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please let us know in the comments below or send us an email at cs at flycraftusa.com.